Uh, thanks again for coming out to our concert tonight. We hope you've enjoyed all the selections and our lovely um, festive attire for the evening. Some of our students are very creative. Um, all of the groups have done an excellent job tonight, and um, I'm actually I'm really proud of not only the big ensembles, but the small groups that are performing. Those are all done on their own. They do that themselves, and I think that they did a really good job, um, including the chamber orchestra that did it all on their own. a very fortunate program here at Timber Creek. Um, the department and the orchestra program were, were very, very lucky. Um, our next concert is actually for the orchestra program is on Tuesday, December 13th at 7 p.m. right here in Timber Creek Auditorium. Um, free admission and it includes our winter silent auction, which we are still collecting donations for if you would like to participate in that. Um, that particular concert is the first time that we showcase uh, the full orchestra, the TCO Philharmonic, so that will be in the program that night. We also have, uh, coming up on Saturday, December 10th, that is the Department Winter Prism Concert. Tickets for that are $5. It is a fundraiser for the um, department for us to be able to have funds for our programs. It's $5. You have to purchase them online with school pay. Information for that will be going out amongst all of the programs um, around November 1st, which is very soon. So we'll be getting that information for you, but I encourage you, please go ahead and get those tickets. Um, once we sell out, we sell out. Okay, so you want to make sure you get those tickets. We have been full house for the last several performances, okay? Um, so again, that's on Saturday, December 10th. We have two shows, 2 p.m. and 7 p.m., so mark your calendars now. Um, I would like to thank all of our TCO officers for their fantastic work on everything they've done getting this program put together. Um, also, the work that they've done behind the scenes um, for other stuff that's been going on, not even just for tonight's concert, but in general making the program work. They are an excellent crew. Um, they make me a little bit more sane, a little bit less crazy, um, but I do really appreciate all of the efforts of our officers. Also, our parent officers that have been working um, behind the scenes as well, I'd like to thank them. Our administration team, who is incredibly supportive of our program and our department. And I would also like to thank our staff. I know, um, I think I saw Ms. Rigno somewhere in the audience. Um, we have staff that come out and work with the students. We're very fortunate for that as well. Um, and then also, I, I know he was coming back and forth um, because Avalon had a, a concert with the band program, but Mr. Conrad, our um, middle school feeder, also is very supportive of our program, and I'd like to thank him as well. So thank you to all of those people. They are wonderful, and they make this program what it is. Um, <laughs> so uh, again, thank you for attending tonight. We hope you've enjoyed the concert. We have two final selections for you tonight. Um, just so you know, these two selections, we are actually going to be recording. The symphony students have a rehearsal tomorrow and then recording on Friday. There's never a dull moment around here. We have another performance on Monday for school. You know, it just never stops. But we are currently applying for the Orlando Philharmonic Orchestra of Distinction Award, which is open to all Central Florida um, schools. And we are applying for that this year. Part of that application includes a recording. So we are actually, the next two pieces are going to be a part of that process. We are still working on them, um, but tonight we will be recording them as well. So just um, as long as you're aware that we are doing a recording for those. Um, but we hope you enjoy it. So thank you again. Um, join us for our trick-or-treat extravaganza. That will be in the media center. It's a dollar admission and lots of really good treats. Um, all the students and parents have participated in that, including my one-year-old. He made treats, so you should come. It's a lot of fun. Um, but thank you again for coming out tonight, and have a wonderful evening.